Hello and welcome back for the sixth episode of my RC Tugboat build vlog. Today we're gonna glue in the second layer of the deck. Before we do that, we have to think about the rear bench and we might also do some work on the steering house. So let's get working. Before we close the steering house with the roof and add all the fittings, I'll be treating it with some marine varnish. And to get a good result, I recommend to thin it down a little bit for the first few layers. The steering house has gotten its first coat of marine varnish and I forgot to uh, talk about the mixture I'm using here. So this is one part marine varnish to two parts of thinner and this stuff really goes a long way. So we will be using this exact mixture for the next layer and then we will gradually use less and less thinner. While the steering house is drying, let's install the second layer of the deck. Quick update from my work on the deck. Um, as I tried to fit the second layer of the deck, I realized it was simply too large. So I had to cut out a section here at the front, uh, which was quite tricky because you need to respect the symmetry. And as a consequence of that, uh, this hatch here became smaller. So I had to adjust this counterpart as well. But now everything should be fitting. And this means we can uh, give it a coat of marine varnish.
this is how far I've come for this episode. The steering house has, got, has gotten its uh, shiny glossy finish, the deck is in. I had some difficulties to make the steering house fit into uh, the opening of the deck. And as you can see here, I went a bit overboard with the Dremel, uh, cut away a slightly too much uh, of the deck. And now I have this little gap here. I'll have to find a solution for that. Other than that, um, I'm quite pleased. And I think we can start to prime the hull in the next episode and think about a color scheme. I've got myself this classic blue and, and red combination here, um, but I'm not fully decided on the colors. So uh, if you have any suggestions, please leave a comment. And I say thank you for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and see you next time. Goodbye.